to one of the church the lord jesus said i will give you the hidden manna now manna is something to be eaten right so he said i will give you the hidden manna because you are under persecution you have no food to eat you cannot buy any food because without the mark of the beast you cannot buy or sell no business transaction your credit cards won't work because the only credit card that you can carry is the number or the mark on your hand or on your forehead and do you know the world is not sure slowly shifting towards that in the past you know when you have a computer or a laptop you just key in a password to open your system then it transition into laptops that have fingerprint access right so now you instead of a password you just put your fingerprint and the scanner goes in and it reads you and say okay cleared now the modern laptops have iris scan recognition system see it trans it progress from a password to fingerprint now to iris scan so now you put your eyes look straight into the <laughs> and it goes through your retina scans your retina and say you are cleared so what is the next the next is just wave your hand because you have the mark here or show your forehead because the mark is there see how we are been psycho conditioned from point from place to place we have been psycho conditioned so that when the mark eventually comes we will be so fooled we will be so comfortable and we will be so deep and deceive into thinking this is a better choice a better choice because if you have a credit card the card can be stolen you can lose the card you can leave the card at home and you come you go to the supermarket you suddenly you realize you forgot your card but you have the card in your, if you have the number in your hand your hand goes with you wherever it goes right you know the indians eat with their hands so yesterday my secretary asked me why do indians eat with their hands i said the answer is very simple the hand is with you all the time You know the fox and the knife you don't know where it went <laughs> a person with some terrible sickness could have used it right but your hand you know it's with you all the time so it's always clean and hygienic so learn to eat with your hands so we are being progressively psycho conditioned to accept this transition as if it is just part of the next progressive being a smart people now you have smart nation smart cities you have smart phones you don't have smart people <laughs> that is why we have smart phones right see the, <laughs> the phones are so smart today they remember everything except us how many of you remember the numbers of your family members we don't anymore we don't we all depend on the smartphones because we are not smart so they want to make smart people how to make them smart people put a chip in your hand and you know years ago the lord showed me once you get the chip in your hand the antichrist will talk to everybody at the same time wirelessly with a chip in your hand let me give you an example now you have a a phone when the phone company wants to send a message to you they don't call you up individually they send you a text message right one press of a button say 100000 subscribers to this particular phone company will all receive a message at the same time in just seconds because of the sim card in the phone in the same manner with the antichrist sim card mark in your hand 
he will likewise communicate with everybody at the same time through that chip wirelessly and then he can you can be told what to do you can be told what to expect you can be told where to go what to do that is why the bible says he who takes the mark of the beast there is no more repentance for him no more because you become like a zombie once you take the mark you are a zombie don't think you can cut out the mark out no you can't do that it's part of your system now it's part of you so don't ever be deceived by any manner of technological talk saying oh it is harmless whenever you don't like it you can just remove it those are just lies lies